So here's a great tip that you probably didn't know about. So here I have two overlapping circles, one in magenta and one in cyan. And these two circles are 50% opacity and therefore the overlapping area will combine the two colors to form a third color. In this case, the third color is a light blue. So if I want to sample this light blue color to know the values of the color, how do I actually do this? Because if we take the eyedropper tool right here and we try to sample this light blue area, we will simply sample the color of this entire cyan circle. No matter if I click right here or if I click right here. It is still cyan as you can see right here in the fill. So one way to do this is by taking a screenshot and import this right back into the Illustrator program and then sample the screenshot. But that's a very tedious way and here's a smart way to do it instead. We simply go to window in the top of the screen. Here we will go to navigator and open the navigator panel. If you want you can drag the navigator panel out in the open and make it a bit bigger. So now with the eyedropper tool selected, we can simply start sampling outside the navigator panel and then move the eyedropper tool inside the navigator panel to sample the color inside the navigator, which is also the same color as this one. Now you can watch this next video that YouTube recommends for you.